What's up, YouTube? It's your buddy Willet. What's up in the sky 37 channel, or catch me out online at www.whatsupinthesky.com. Um, as always, we've got something interesting from you for the. This is the Curiosity Rover, and I want to get a couple weekends done, or a couple videos done before this weekend. I'm going to the Firefly Festival. I got my three-day tickets in Dover, Delaware. Red Hot Chili Peppers. Uh, Tom Petty, there's going to be like 30 bands. If you live on the East Coast and you're watching this, uh, what's today? Today is Wednesday, June 19th. Come out this weekend. You can still get your tickets online. There, uh, each day is uh, 107 bucks, so it's 300 bucks for the weekend, but well worth it. It's like the Bonnaroo of the East Coast now, except for up north. There's still a couple really good uh, music. So I'm, I'm into music. I'm a musician. You can see guitar back behind me. But let's look at this. You guys really don't care about me. You come to see these are these crazy things on Mars um, and the moon. So we're looking at something here that this Mike Michael Witter has an awesome channel. I just saw his. He had put this up, and I had to come look at this with you guys. Let's see. He, he looks like a, some sort of religious medallion here. What he I think that's what he called it. But uh, this whole picture, I just looked at it briefly. It has a lot of cool stuff in it. A lot of right angles. Some uh, this says IR9. Let's 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 take a quick look at this. Here's how we do it. Usually we come in and just show you the main anomaly. I want to show you that's the one that I'm really interested in. And then also, there's this thing that looks like a little pole sticking straight up out of the ground. It actually looks like a, uh, we all know what it looks like. <laughs> and uh, it looks like some wires or something coming off of it. I tell you what, these the more these rover pictures come back, they're just, a, I swear they're just saying ancient civilization on Mars. I mean, if you listen to the United States presidents for the last 10 10 go rounds most of them had hinted to it you know so let's take a look here at some of these other rocks um, well you know let me show you where to get this from just in case you're interested in pulling it up see how the color comes like this what I've done is if you want to jet now you saw the anomaly go ahead um, if not stick here with me I'm gonna reset it what I, I get that this is how NASA sends it and what I do is what they do too they call it white balancing I uh, let's see here Basically, you drop the temperature, which brings that that color, that real Marsy red they give it. I swear, it can't, it's not like that. They put stuff out all the time and, and white, white balance it so we can see what it would look like from Earth. But I'm saying this is what it looks like all the time. When you use the white balance, the sky turns blue. It's pretty amazing. But there's also a couple other anomalies. Let's go back and there's some down here we're going to want to look at. And... Uh, but what we really want to look at right now is come up here and let's take a look at that like that little medallion. Um, now, come tell me that's matrixing, or uh, you know, come tell me that that's my eyes. That you know, that's not so. That's nature made that. It's a perfect thing. I mean, it almost almost looks like wire on it. Maybe this is metal. Who knows? Sometimes a lot of this stuff looks like some sort of uh, die cast or something that. It doesn't. Who knows what the technology or what they actually had there? How far advanced they were? My my assumption they're going to be pretty far advanced. But if you check this out, it looks like they smudged this. This looks like it says I R S, and I didn't do that or one R S. And if you can see, this whole area has been smudged. You can tell because look at this. Look at the uh, look at the okay. Look at the contrast in between this moving up to where they smudge this is the smudge mark right here it's a circle if you back out you see it a little better there and what did they smudge writing that's what it looks like did that come down off the rover I've never seen that on a picture if you guys have seen that before let me know this looks almost like a uh, this is a good 90 degree angle and would come here and it, they must have had something right there some something that they didn't want us to see but they left that there and then when you come here they left this in there that's just too cool I mean, what makes that? Have you seen, have you been walking around? I know there's certain places that have like, uh, what, salt growth and stuff that looks like that, but that's just, that's pretty cool. Being this next to, and what people say is if you go back and look at, uh, this is video number 48 for Mars. Um, almost all my videos, if you just go watch, go sit and watch some of them, you're going to see this stuff is everywhere. Every rover we sent up there has found it. Um, the rocks that come back, I mean, these rocks, they, they look nothing like, uh, you know, this stuff looks shaped. A lot of them, they, they're windy. I, I'm, I'm a nature lover. I sit outside. I love watching nature. And I take pictures all the time. People are like, well, you go take pictures of a rocky outcropping and everything will look the same. It doesn't. 
It, it doesn't. This looks like a planet just got thrashed. This looks like one of those ancient sites that you would go to and uh, have to dig, you know, and have to poly you sit there with your brushes and get this stuff off. I mean, this somewhere it looks like it's been destroyed. Mars has been ravaged. Um, something tore it up, but there's probably a lot more anomalies in there. As always, I'm going to go ahead and post what I do down there. This stuff is cool, but that's from the rover. That's nothing uh, nothing too cool. I, this rover up there is awesome. If this is really on Mars, and, you know, and I say that well, you know, because you never know. I mean, everything else on TV seems to be a lie now that we find out. They're always lying. Or it's, it's, or it's not a lie, it's a uh, you know, half-truth, or they're pointing us in a direction for a reason. Um, what do you guys see? Let me know down below. I'm letting this go long. This weekend I won't be here. Don't get worried. What's up in the sky.com. Go check out some old videos. I'll be back with new ones next week. I'm probably going to do one or two more tonight. I'm in, a, I'm in a good mood. Pumped up for this weekend at the Firefly Festival in Dover, Delaware. If you're going to be coming there, hit up my page. Let me know you're coming. And we'll catch up. Talk Mars. Talk bands. Much love. See ya.